Sight now, sight now, stay tuned. Don't be kennel blind. Same thing, y'all know what to do. Check, pop your top down at the bottom. What I do, I hit mine at the bottom, it pops right on. Get my needle, run it through, get it, be careful because sometimes these tops slip and the needle will be there. What you're gonna do, you're gonna take a twist. Come on, make sure. Same thing, y'all. Taking our liquid, which is gonna be the lime top. Get in there, get out a little bit. Bing, bow, boom. Bing, bam, thank you, man. All right, Sam. All right, you get that? Y'all know what we're gonna do. Add it to our powder. Boom, we dropping it. Dropping it in by itself. I love this. I wanna know something crazy? I have a fear of needles. Till, till I became a dog breeder, I didn't really get over. Ah, it's a needle like, boy, I used to crazy. Drop down in the comments with all my people. Get a needle. Give me y'all worst doctor experience. We're going to get a shot. Mine, personally, I got put out a couple of uh, clinics because I was biting the nurse before they even administered it. Stuck me. As soon as I smelled that alcohol rub, oh, I already knew what. Ah, bite you. We, hey, I'm going to call my sister and I'm going to see if I add it to this video. She'll tell you. And, and the words of being her words is going to be I'll bite, I'll bite, I'll bite. Trust me. I got put out. Like, I used to have to have my uncle go take me, all kind of stuff, bro. But here I am, giving it to the dogs like it ain't nothing. Bing, bang, bang. Let's get the air out. Boom. There we are. I'm going to recap it. And that's done. All right, we didn't did the four. Now we about to go ahead, break it down, get the dog. About to get them up. They're taking naps, but it's the best time to go ahead and give your puppy a shot. Cause you don't gotta give them all kind of treats. They're still kind of woozy and out. By the time you stick them in, we're gonna know it's out there. Get right back and go to sleep. Boom. Stay tuned for the first. Puppy. What's going on YouTube? We locked in. We back. Yeah, I'm about to go ahead and show you how to do these shots. Just stay tuned. Real simple. You got your liquid. Got your powder. I'm gonna take your sterile needle. I'm gonna put it together. I'm gonna put it together real quick, man. Make sure, you know what I'm saying? Tight. What I do is I take it and I just pop it like that. As y'all see, it come right off. There we go. We're gonna test it to see if our needle's on right. Oh, it is. Be careful, be safe. Oh, we don't want any air. We're gonna lock it in. We're gonna put it in our liquid. Get it at an angle. Suck it in. You'll see it. Pull your needle out just a little bit of love. When you put it in here, it's just pretty much gonna drop down for itself, y'all. Y'all see? Give it a little love. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Check it back, check it back. Don't beat the needle though. That will hurt your animal. All right, once you get that, you can get a pink solution. Go ahead, take your needle, draw it back in. Get it by right there, let some air go back in. Get the rest that was in there. It should come out with about one mil. Squeeze the air out. What you want to do, make sure it's very important. See all this air still left in here? A lot of people will do this and stick their dog. Oh, that is not good. That is not going to get you anywhere but a dead dog. Go ahead, push it all the way. You can see it going in the valve. 
and you get a little leak on the needle. As you can see here. And when you get that drip, put it back. Get ready. We can give him a five and one. This guy here. If the dog was to be a person, scared of needles, this is him. I'm gonna check everything out, but he ain't gonna know how to pass out here. One, two, three, dog. Right Rub it down. Rub it next. Whoa, whoa. You alright? Ooh, you're getting heavy, boy. Getting heavy. I don't know if I'm going to be good on one-on challenge with this big one. One-on challenge, y'all. Six months. Production. Y'all see them 10 points coming in on them? Uh-oh. Going to be a stopper right here, man. This is going to be a show stopper. This is my boy, Royal. We're going to open him up at 500 Five hundred dollar lock in, seven fifty total. We starting them off ten spots, just like that. Five hundred lock in, seven fifty is the total on his feet. After he ten, he's going up. This guy's gonna be a major producer, just like his pops. He's not lacking anything. Guy got bone, dome, and a full tail. That's what well in the back. This is Kong. We opening up Kong at the same thing, $500 lock in, $750 is your total of the whole breeding. Locking them in, 10 slots. Let's get it. This guy's super short. I'm talking about. Bro, when he was born, I just knew he was gonna be, he was gonna be that stud. Sweet guy, man. Good temperament, everything. I'm loving the, the split face. And on the eyes, man. The eyes done. He is trying. He will swell your world with that Merle. Cryptic Merle. Yes, sir. Short, stocky. Little back. Ain't missing nothing on that rear. And we got shoulder blade. Oh, bows too. Forgot to tell you. But let's get his shots done. And his ears are healing up so good, guys. I mean, they had, it looked like it had some keloids on it. Got that shit done, got got uh things I needed to put on it. And that was over with. I love this guy. Been treating, been treating the ears with, I'll show you guys here in a minute. Let me go ahead and get this guy. This guy here, it was called one on channel. Six months, man. Look, look at that. Production. It's produced, not bought. Even if it's bought, I'm gonna produce something off it. You dig, but this is all me. I'm talking about look at the detail to the eyebrows. Yeah, man. Black. Try it down, man. Brindle. Don't be scared of that Brindle. So don't be don't be kennel blind, man. We hustling. Straight hustlers. Good deal. I'm talking about good solid weight on the pup. We starting to add the weight on them now. Yeah, man. When y'all see this boy in another two months, rumble in the jungle, 4.4, 5.0. Yeah, man. Again, making noise. We are there again, y'all. Um, Top Dollar Westmont Festival. We in the building. We coming with it, bringing the clothes, in the cut, young hippies. That's what we doing, man. Reinvesting your brain. When this guy start producing, don't tell me nothing, man. Don't miss out. 750? Come on, man, you can't miss. Early lock in. Shit, you breed them out. You see what all these brothers and sisters is, they got tell. Let's do it. Let's do it. Swell. You know what I'm saying? His ears are coming out great, so I'm talking about good definition. They starting to close. Be careful with those ears, man. Yeah, 
yeah, these are some of the products I use. I'm not sponsored. I'm just telling y'all what I know would work for me to get their ears back right. I didn't suffer from infection, but I did suffer from when they kept tearing their ears. Bro, these dogs is hard when they playing. This is for the skin treatment. I'm talking about y'all gotta get the sulfur and all that. Good stuff at the bottom of the mix. You should give it a couple of shakes, but man, I'm telling you, God, this does wonders for my dogs. This right here also played a big role in helping my dog's ears. I'm talking about, you know, follow the instructions. It tells you what, what this for. Ear infections, hot spots, ringworms, wounds. Well, oh, man, I fixed it all. And on the back here, it was uh, telling you about, you know, itchy skin, wounds, uh, insect bites, rashes, dog bites. You know, I have a couple of those, so they, these are pups, man. They, they're going to play a little rough. Ringworms and hot spots. As a bullet breeder, you need this. Top. Top thing to have. With these dogs having tricky skin issues, also, it don't matter. Sometimes it's the food, sometimes it's the air, sometimes it's just the dust, bro. These dogs' skin gets sensitive. But this is the pop to everybody. His stuff is at 2000 right now, 1500 You know, if you're gonna go, uh, we're gonna go all in, I'll do 500 uh, deposit, 1000 lock in, we we'll do 1500 That's all in those. But if you're gonna wait and come do it the same day you pull up, he had 2000 Man, this dude is a proven producer. He hasn't let me down yet. He's on his, what, seventh litter? Guy got puppies. I'm talking about crazy deals. Picking the letter, and also I'm buying the mom. So I'm gonna shut it down. So y'all stay tuned. Beach man, check out this boy though, man. Lacks nothing. Big head. Oh, this is where you get all them. This is where they get all that tribe from. Oh, chicken. Big chest. Big neck. Got 90 degrees. 45, good bite, look at that bite, look at that bite, yes sir, look at that rear, look at that rear, like, no, oh, big chest, oh yeah, big chest, last time I weighed him, he was at uh, 56, 56, I'm talking about my boy don't like nothing, that's my guy, man. Proven producer. I'm happy with him. Like I said, y'all want to lock in. He's a cryptic Merle. Um, he has pan points. When I first got him, I just knew from the picture that I seen in our wife's shout out, Glamour Bulls. Hey, check out her page, bro. Y'all be sleep on, on the people who don't have these big names. But, bro, yeah. Back to the I seen the pups she was producing. I was like, man, I'm about to book it. I guess she thought I was playing. Took out to New York, landed. Back to story time. Like I said, I got this guy. Um, shout out, like I said, Glamour Bull with a Z at the end, not an S. Man, her daughter uh, was kind of heartbroken, but I had to come get that bitch milk. I knew he, if I had him in my program, he was gonna be a known producer. And then me just having the hustle and the mouthpiece that I have and also understanding business and how to do good business, bro, I knew this was gonna be the dog that changed my life. So, he came off a pocket with his dad, with a, uh, with a tribe Merle, a blue tribe Merle, which carries into, you see, into his grandchildren. Um, got, what, what, what his dad did was bring a nice, subtle, good walk that I seen to him, a show walk, good bones, but the mom, man, remember, you got a good bitch at the bottom, come on, bro, you gonna be a deuce. Mom's like this, bowed up, shoulders, neck, everything he carries from the girthy side come from his mom. Right? Hey, girl. After that, seeing that, let's do our homework. I mean, me, I'm in the smaller dogs now. Like I said, I took her, her production and made smaller micros. Like I said, took them. Now we're gonna run micros and micros this time. We're gonna kill it. So we gotta get as booty breeders. We got to start getting better. It's getting hotter outside. These dogs are dying. They're not gonna be lasting long, especially if you're putting too much inbred. You know what I'm saying? Kind of, 
But yeah, y'all get it. But yeah, look. Keep y'all water, pee light, alcohol, right? Get the dog outside, bro. Let the dog breathe. Just like if you were to have a seizure, fall or something, hit your head, they tell you, let him get room. Let him go ahead. All right, tune back in. As you know, we updated y'all last time. We did the shots. They had their 10 and 1 already. I was out of town, so I couldn't give her up first. But they already done with it. So.